Welcome to the Brotherhood of Nod. Our relationship with Tiberian has always been greatly misunderstood. Most people do not realize that the roots of our faith extend back several millennium, long before the emergence of the green crystal on Earth in 1995. An event foreseen by our great leader, Cain. The existence of Tiberium was covered up for years by GDI. They call themselves the Global Defense Initiative, but they are actually a fascist political consortium of wealthy nations hell-bent on controlling the sacred green crystal. While GDI suppressed the truth about Tiberium, the Brotherhood worked tirelessly to acquire samples of the precious crystal, to study it, to unlock its potential as a new energy source. The mainstream media branded us terrorists. But in 2019, we exposed GDI as the real terrorists and forced them to confess their heinous sins against humanity. Once the truth was made public, the Brotherhood grew exponentially. People from all walks of life flocked to our faith. We worked tirelessly spreading Tiberium around the globe so that those without would benefit from the vast powers of the green crystal. For our efforts, we were relentlessly attacked by GDI and their army of power mongers. The result was two pointless world wars that succeeded only in killing millions. When the Brotherhood could not be eliminated through war, GDI used a more subversive tactic. They unilaterally redrew all international border lines, relegating all Nod followers into inhospitable yellow zones while claiming the pristine and exclusive blue zones all for themselves. Now, despite rumors of Cain's death, the Brotherhood remains stronger than ever. Our commitment to Tiberium undying. And with your help, we will continue to spread the gospel of the great green crystal. And he cried in a loud voice, Lazarus, come forth. And Lazarus did arise from the grave. I have always believed that faith was measured in deeds, not words. And while many of my children worshipped my name, their deeds betrayed them. In my absence they strayed from the path, but you, you my son, your faith never waned. Not at Honduras or in Jericho. Not in the great Rio insurrection. You risked your life countless times to topple GDI, to perpetuate our cause, to honor my name. And now I call upon you again to bring glory to the Brotherhood. I have seen that GDI is vulnerable, bloated by arrogance and complacency. Now is the time to strike. While they congratulate themselves on Tiberium advancements, Nod made decades ago, we will expose their weaknesses for all the world to see. Nache will brief you on your mission. Like you, his faith is unquestioned. So you're the one everyone's been talking about. Legendary insurgent. I hope you're as good as they say you are, Commander. Because we're throwing you right in the frying pan. Check it out. This is Goddard Space Center, Greenbelt, Maryland. Ground control to GDI's ASAT system. All of their missile defenses. You're going to take a small squad over there and wipe out the whole installation. Take the system offline. Now make sure you knock out the communications first so they can't call for backup. Then go stealth and do that nasty thing you do. Wish I could tell you what Kane's got planned, but then I'd have to kill you. <laughs> Just kidding. But seriously, I envy you, brother. The world's about to change and you're going to be right there in the thick of it. It's an exciting time to be Nod. If you need me, Commander, I got your back.
My instincts about you were correct. Your execution of that mission was exquisite. I have linked your battle interface with my command console. I want you to have the privilege of starting the Third Tiberium War. The war to end all wars. Go ahead, my son. Push the button. Inscribe your place in history with the blood of GDI. our destiny within grasp. Philadelphia was only the beginning. Our forces will spread like a great plague across the earth. Every blue zone will feel our wrath. But for you, for you, my son, I have reserved the most important mission of all, taking the northeastern blue zone. We have a secret attack force awaiting your command. You must show no mercy, for GDI deserves none. Watch this a hundred times, probably will. But right now, time to take the war to GDI. Take it right under their big, fat, overstuffed living rooms. You got two targets Andrews Air Force Base or the White House. Man, I'll give my left nut to see some real action. I'll take one of these targets out of myself. Anyway. Andrews is our air command in the region. You take it out first, you won't have to worry about death from above. The White House isn't really tactical. They don't run central command from there or anything. But it is an important monument, so if you sack it, you'll create a nice diversion for yourself. Your choice. You can't go wrong either way. Get some from me, Commander. I was saying how pleased I am with your progress. General Qatar tells me you two have never met, but I'm sure you've heard of her deeds. Besides yourself, she is the greatest military asset we have. The Philadelphia strike was her idea. My idea, I guess. But it was your vision that made it possible. And our commander who made it happen. Now, my son, you must help me unveil phase two of this campaign. I'm going abroad now to make final preparations, but General Qatar will personally oversee your upcoming missions. Afford her the same reverence you offer me. Kane is correct. We've made good progress. Better than I thought possible at this stage. But we have awoken a sleeping giant. GDI will retaliate with a force that will test our resolve. It's up to you, Commander, to show the world that Nod will not back down. 